In the morning I open my curtains to a foggy sky and a carpet of snow on the street. Seeing people putting hot water on their cars. In school it's like a winter wonderland with snowmen all around the field with random patches spread across the playground. All you can hear is children's feet crunching in the real white snow. Screaming and laughter from the kids having snow fight. My fingers are blue. Our winter blanket covers barns and field and the playground. The snow makes a crunching noise when you roll a snowball or snowman. I can hear people screaming and talking and I can sm smell slutchy water crunching. I can feel a winter breeze down my back. In assembly this morning it was phenomenal because I didn't know what was going to happen because we were listening to assembly and then Miss Williams came bursting through the doors and told us all that we could go outside before break time. To go outside in the snow and build snowmen and have snowball fights and do snow angels. The snow thickens the air, it is cold and icy today. I can hear the snow cracking beneath my feet. I got in a snow fight. It is mad here. The vanilla snow lay down like a white blanket floating down from the sky. Snowmen stand in the cold slowly turning to ice and water. Whilst the snow drops, my nose glows and in the background you can hear cheering as snowballs are launching in all different directions. Today's been amazing because It's like a new experience. I hurried to school. It's break time, shouted Mrs. Williams. Everybody shot up and ran outside. I stood at the top of the hill. It was like a fluffy white carpet. The floor getting chased by a snowball. Big dints of snow scattered all around. Dents in the ground filled the ice cold water green muddy tracks where snowballs have been rolled, rosy cheeks, tingling toes, but sadly the snow has to go. Today's been amazing because Mrs Burns let us go outside building snowmen and me and some other children with Mr Morris and Mr Jones made a really big snowman that was bigger than all the rest. And Mr. Morris and Mr. Jones tried to get the children to help them lift the, bod the body onto the base, and they couldn't lift it until Miss McMullen tried to help. We used a census map to help us with our writing about the snow, and we also went outside to help us do it. I will never forget 
when I looked out of the window and saw to my surprise it was snowing. I couldn't wait until we could go out. I could hear the laughter of children, the water like a fish dancing. I saw a snowman standing. I saw a white carpet covering the field. I feel frozen, stiff like a really strong spider web. I can smell the fresh air and the cold breeze on my feet. The snow breaking slowly and sadly.